Hi viewers, welcome to our YouTube channel Electrical Lectures. In this video, I will be showing you how to insert figures or images in your latex document by using overleaf environment. In the previous video, I have already shown you how to write a basic document by using overleaf online. And in this video, you will learn how to insert figures and images in your latex document. So let us start. First of all, you will open overleaf.com and after signing in, you will create a new project. For this, you will go on the left hand side and click new project and then blank project. Here you will write the name of the project. I am naming it as first project and press enter. Overleaf will create a new project for you and will provide you with a basic document structure. The first step to insert figures is to import the image files in the directory of Overleaf. To do this, you will go into the left hand side menu and click this upload button. Now you will select your desired figures by clicking this button select from your computer. Go to the directory from where you want to import figures and select all figures at the same time. I want to insert these two figures namely figure 1 and figure 2. Click open. Overleaf will import these two figures and you can see figure 1 and figure 2 they are imported here. Now after importing the figures in Overleaf, now you need to write the proper command to publish the figures in your PDF document. For this you will use begin figure and Overleaf will help you in selecting the proper syntax. Just click this particular line and you see Overleaf has automatically provided you the complete syntax. Just you need to write the name of the figure here figure1.jpg and in order to make the size of the figure consistent with the text you need to write square bracket and inside square bracket you will write width is equal to backslash line width so it will make the size of the figure consistent with the text also if you want to import figures one of the main things is you need to use this particular package which is graphics so you need to write this particular line in the header use package graphics now we are done press ctrl s and you will see that this figure is successfully imported in your pdf document also you can change the caption by default, it is only written caption here. You can change the caption to your choice. For example, I write here my first figure. And you can also change the label as well. Again, press Ctrl S and you can see that the caption of the figure is changed. Another important aspect that I would like to highlight in this video is to place multiple figures by using subfigure environment for example if you want to place two figures like figure 1a and 1b then how to do that for this you need to use another package which is subfigure so you write here use package and here subfigure select this one it is the desired package and now we see what changes we need to do in the figure environment. Now we will use subfigure command in order to import multiple figures. So we will write subfigure and then inside curly braces you will write include graphics and here you will again specify the size of the figure as width is equal to line width and in the curly braces you will write the name of the figure figure one dot jpg now this is our first figure 
and similarly you will invoke the command again the subfigure command and inside the curly braces you will import the second figure include graphics again width is equal to backslash line width and here you will write the second figure which is figure 2 dot png now click save and you will see these two figures are placed here as sub figures now since we have not mentioned the caption of each figure here that is why we are not able to see any caption in the pdf file if you want to mention the caption this is the place after sub figure command where you can mention the caption let's say i want to mention here figure 1a and similarly here i will write figure 1b and then control s so you can see here that the first one is labeled as figure 1a and the second one is labeled as figure 1b so you see here these two figures are placed as sub figures and now if you want to put a main caption for the complete figure you can also do that by writing caption and here main caption press ctrl s and you can see here that this is the main caption and these are two captions for the sub figures so hopefully you have learned the procedure how to insert Im images or figures in your latex document by using overleaf thank you for watching this video stay tuned to our channel electrical lectures